One thing about Miss XO, uh, she keeps us on the edge of our seat, okay? Why would I want to go watch Bad Boys, Bad Boys? Uh, what you gonna do? Uh, what you gonna do? And they come for you. It's Nick, it's Nick. Uh, uh, don't tell me about the lyrics. I sing what I hear, not what is written, okay? Okay, like. Why must I go to the bioscope when I have Miss XO at home on my smart TV? Why? Don't you just never? Yan amugela kun oboya mi bum taba dad bum taba koko bum taba anti bum ta baka sissy. I am Sims and it's at the right Sims on Instagram. So please uh, follow your sister. <laughs> Yo, singing is like a skill that I was late in the queue for. You know, they took the singing talent and gave it to Ranzu. Hey, Bo, guys, let me tell you about this beautiful, beautiful girl by the name of Uranzu, guys. So, Uranzu is also part of management, right? She also has her own YouTube channel where everything I'm um, regarding her Christianity. God, the word, even food, great conversations take place on that channel. Please subscribe to her, right? And she's only on 16 subscribers, guys. We can do so much better for her as management. Let's go over there. Shab, Ranzu has an EP out and such an amazing, amazing voice, okay? I've been listening to the EP and there's a song. It's called Cleanse Me. Oh my goodness. I've played that song on repeat so so much it's such a beautiful song like it just speaks to me more than anything so she's got an ep out guys let us support her let us show her some love i will leave her link in the description box down below please do the right thing ranzu you have my subscription you have my prescription you have my description you have my description this wasn't part of the plan until God started the conversation. I dreamt this for other people and I still do because I wanted to help them accomplish such a dream. But I'd never thought that I would have to do this. And now, now I did it. Why? Because God said so. Cheers to obedience and your journey, my first step. Okay, now let us talk about our colleague. We are talking about Ukoli Gabashi. Sorry, her, it's not Gabashi with an X, it's Gabashi with a GC. So Ukoli is um, popular here on YouTube. She does lifestyle content and she is popular, really. Popularly English. English when I English when I catch you and I sit across with you from a room. Only one of us will make it out. And it will not be the Oxford dictionary, it will be me. Why are you doing this to me on a public platform? English? You Queen Elizabeth? She is popularly known as Auntie Darling. So now we know that. Um, Miss XO has chosen a new path, right? She has accepted Christ in her life. Therefore, she's just on like her Christian path. And we are seeing her like go through her spiritual journey and her, relig her religious journey currently on her channel. Now, this took place, I think, in May last year. I think I, I watch Miss XO. I watch it. No, I like her content. I love her content. Um, I think in May last year, she was going through that breakup. <laughs> hey, you know that breakup that makes you start a business. Like, yeah. You start a business. You become a businesswoman. You become a life coach. You become a fitness bunny. Aerobics have never been your friend. But when you go through that breakup, yeah. Yes, when 
Yes, when a gym bunny. Yeah, Jurassic Petri. Yeah, you know that breakup? You don't know. Ask me, Sally. Ask me. Ask me. That breakup, it's like you can go to a hospital and find a doctor and just say, Doctor, doctor, just please remove. <laughs> can you just remove this part? <laughs> I don't need it. I don't need it. And then there's just that one when you are just that one tear that just we are the champion. You know that one tear? You don't know. Listening to Metro FM on a Sunday. Sunday has never been so long. A Sunday. When you're going through it, ah, it's like <laughs> there's no Petru 27 colors. Yeah. You guys don't please. If you've never been a business, a life coach, a director, a motivational speaker, a gym band, they haven't done mincemeat to your heart. Your heart has never been to a hostel. It hasn't. So, so she went through one of those and then she was just like, God, if you can just take this part away, that pain, just take this pain away. I promise you, I'm going to give myself to you, the word, church, everything. I'm going to just go on this path. Hi again. And on this path, she went. Guys, we have seen Miss XO like just rebrand, like just become this. You went now. Coating scriptures. She's just, it's, it's beautiful to watch, guys. It's beautiful to watch some, especially when you've seen like them like go through everything like on their channel. And to see them like come full circle to this moment, I was there, guys, you know. So now she says that the last part of her um, journey was her letting go of the name Miss X O Six. Now you know that Miss X O Six was Oli's um, social media name. That's the name we got to know and love her from. Okay, so she got this name um, when she was um, big on Twitter. You know. She was choosing a Twitter handle and it so happened to be Miss X06 and she just went by that name everywhere on social media. Sharp. So she says that with this journey and that name, mm -mm, because that name it just is just it's attached to too many things. It's just too much. It's just too much to us. You know, that name was just like, yes, 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 yes. Yeah, I had to go through that phase of being that girl, but nah. I'm no longer that a hand like cut me off remove me off your page remove me off your page okay so now she's just like no guys don't worry um i uh, thanks to salty and mass because i didn't see that instagram story so um she wrote on her instagram so it's good to know listen here i'm not hacked this is me it's just that this is me me i'm now going by my name it's just totally gabashi you know not miss xo anymore that name was just attached to too many things and i just don't want to be that hun no more i am me you know and i was like i don't know in a way i literally saw this coming you know why because there was a time she was doing a q and a right when she was doing a q and a um someone asked her how did um you choose the name miss xo and then she was telling us the story on twitter the handle what what and then she was like but nah man that name like it don't feel like me no more like it ain't me no more okay and just and then she used up black china as an example you know she was like just look at black china after she went through her own journey like she just decided to like be angela white just go by her name angela white and just let um black china be Avbop. oh sunlam oh it will lead to funeral oh so now and now she's just like i'm just not miss x06 anymore like nah, um, that 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 is under, under the cemetery, under the six feet underground. Underneath that six feet is a basement. So keep that name there. Right now, I just wanna be Oli, and you know what name? What I want to to talk about is that the discipline, this girl, the dedication, this girl, yo, the commitment, this girl has has showed us with this journey is just commendable you know it's remarkable guys do you understand like living like a huge part of your life as one person and then like going through all these changes for your belief our 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 this is more dedication than a marathon triathlon runner yeah this is western the only
Olympics because you literally give up almost like you're literally giving up your identity as this because now if i'm always known as sims right sims right and then i come and i say no i am jacobeth and you guys like eh? and now i need to tell you it's like now i'm trying to convince you and then i'm opening myself to so much scrutiny so do you understand because miss xo has faced so much scrutiny since this journey and i'm just sitting there like you know it's wild that we as the viewers, the subscribers, the onlookers, we are so open to accepting wild behavior. You know, when people were going to the club, jumping on the tables, telling you who they sleep with, man, they slept with, man, they slept with who, they did the who, they did the what. You guys are just like, what? <laughs> that is so funny, girl. Tell us more. Tell us more. No, no, no. Yeah. Okay. Tell us more. You know? And then when that person is like, no, you know what? I'm going, I'm getting older. I'm growing wiser. I'm becoming more mature. I don't want to be in seven Zoom meetings. I don't want to do the Vinky Vong call. I, 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 I want to redirect. And you're like, ah, why? Why, why, why? And then what scares me is the space that um, she's redirected to, you know, Christianity. Christians are so hardcore, guys. I don't want to lie. Watching Okoni go on this journey. And I feel like it's, it's the people that are in that... um journey like in that space that are so more judgmental i'm sorry to say but guys like even the other day me personally i was talking about um how i grew up being um adventist you know but instead of saying i was adventist because i was talking about um SD, sda um seventh day adventist church i was talking about being an sda um, member when i was growing up and instead of saying that I was Adventist, I said I was Sabbath. My family grew up as Sabbath um, church members. Yo, yeah, it's called Adventist. Eh. It's just like, but you know what I was trying to say? Like, you know, what I was trying to say like, so sometimes it just feels like Christians are more hardcore. Like we understand, holy guy, you guys are not like, you guys don't like lukewarm Christian, like be about it and be on about it. But sometimes the way you guys go about it is literally so hardcore. And it makes us scared. It makes us scared like me currently. I'm looking for a church. I'm looking for a home to belong to. But how now I'm looking at Miss XO be on this journey. And she's so serious and dedicated to it. But now it's like, she's like, oh, I, it's like you're not good enough. You're not holy enough. You're not this enough. You're not that enough. I, like you need to prove yourself more. It, it really makes us more scared. But I, it's fine. I'll just keep keep to this lane because hey, mm, hey, you know it's like hey you guys can have you can have him guys you can really have him hey it's okay like it's sharp you know so for her to just open herself up to so much ridicule and scrutiny like yo i shame i i command her i command her and she was talking about the things she's given up and she was just like she was doing um a uh, sit down and she was like i no longer listen to circular music um i am more modest you know and the uh, you know even gossip even gossip like i should just like if she finds herself like talking about something or someone that just like is starting to be gossip she just like she catches herself and she's just like no do i no should i mm -mm -ah. so it's just very commendable how she's going about things you know and watching her like I mean more than anything it's the dedication and commitment yo I can't even stick. I cannot even stick to one decision that I made. I'm struggling to just give up sugar for like a few days. Yo! Oh. Uphold that steam. Steam up before anything. And then there's us. I'm a kabish. Potatoes. Hey, Ashem Goli, Ashem Pamil, Aluta Continua. Not that Aluta the scammer, the real Aluta Continua. Guys, in the history of this channel, I have never uploaded on a, on a Saturday. I stand to be corrected, but I've never uploaded on a Saturday. So, this uploading every day in July challenge is really 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 yeah 
because I have to lead by example, okay? I'm forcing everyone to upload everything, so I cannot be exempt. I cannot be exempt. I have to. You know? So, yeah, guys, don't give up. Don't give up. And let me tell you something. I will be, um, I will be showing you, um, how much I made this week on Monday. So on Monday, I'm going to show you how much I made this week so that maybe you guys also like feel, feel like the spirit to continue. And I can tell you already, like I've passed 3000 rands. That's what I can tell you already. I've passed 3000 rands and it's only been week one. Royals, hero. You can't spell it, you can't afford it, so I can't afford it yet. Ten year olds, Royce. Yeah? Yeah?